Look up at the night sky. Can you feel it? The stars shimmering like diamonds, the moon casting its gentle glow, and the infinite vastness of space drawing you in. It's mesmerizing. But have you ever stopped to wonder, amidst this endless cosmic sea, where do we belong? What is Earth's role in this epic celestial dance? Let's embark on a journey from our vibrant, fragile blue oasis to the farthest edges of the observable universe, unraveling mysteries that redefine our place among the stars. Earth, the third planet from the sun, is unique in our solar system. It's a vibrant sphere covered with oceans, continents, and an atmosphere that supports a delicate balance of life. This is our home. But have you ever thought about how Earth fits into the broader universe? Let's zoom out step by step to explore Earth's position in the cosmos. Earth is a geological marvel with tectonic plates that shape its surface, creating mountains, valleys, and oceans over millions of years. The presence of a magnetic field protects it from solar winds, while its diverse ecosystems sustain an astonishing variety of life forms, from microscopic bacteria to towering trees. Our planet's story is one of resilience and adaptation, a testament to the power of nature. The solar system is like a bustling cosmic neighborhood, with Earth as one of its key residents. Eight planets, numerous moons, dwarf planets, asteroids and comets orbit a fiery centerpiece, the Sun. Earth's orbit, at an average distance of about 93 million miles from the Sun, lies within the habitable zone, a region where liquid water can exist. This makes Earth a rarity, a precious jewel in the vastness of space. The Moon is Earth's closest celestial companion, orbiting at an average distance of about 238,855 miles. It might seem far, but the gap isn't as immense as it feels. Picture this. If you could line up all the other planets in our solar system between Earth and the Moon, they would fit with room to spare. The Moon's gravitational influence stabilizes Earth's axial tilt, regulating our seasons and playing a vital role in shaping ocean tides. The Moon also serves as a natural satellite, offering a historical record of our solar system's early years. Its craters, formed by impacts billions of years ago, hold clues about the conditions that shaped Earth's environment. The Sun, a blazing sphere of hydrogen and helium, dwarfs Earth in every way. It's about 864,000 miles in diameter, over 100 times wider than Earth, and could hold over a million Earths within its volume. Its surface temperature reaches approximately 5,500 degrees Celsius, while its core burns at an astonishing 15 million degrees Celsius. This immense energy powers the solar system, driving Earth's climate and sustaining life. Despite its enormity, the Sun is just one star among countless others in our galaxy. From its birth in a stellar nursery to its eventual transformation into a red giant and white dwarf is a process shared by stars across the cosmos. This cycle highlights the interconnectedness of celestial phenomena, reminding us that even stars have finite lifespans. Zooming out further, we find our solar system nestled within the Milky Way galaxy, a sprawling collection of stars, gas, and dust. The Milky Way is a barred spiral galaxy, about 100,000 light years in diameter, with an estimated 100 to 400 billion stars. Our solar system resides in the Orion Arm, about 27,000 light years from the galactic center. This center is home to a supermassive black hole called Sagittarius a star, an enigmatic force that influences the galaxy's structure. If you were to scale down the solar system to the size of a quarter, the Milky Way would span the size of the United States. This analogy underscores the staggering scale of our galaxy and emphasizes Earth's tiny footprint within it. Within the Milky Way, stars are born in vast clouds of gas and dust, known as nebulae. These stellar nurseries, such as the Orion Nebula, are sites of incredible beauty and scientific significance. They remind us that the galaxy is a dynamic, ever-changing entity. The Milky Way is part of a galactic neighborhood known as the Local Group. This cluster comprises over 54 galaxies, including the Andromeda Galaxy and the Triangulum Galaxy. Andromeda, our closest galactic neighbor, lies about 2.5 million light years away. It's a majestic spiral galaxy and is on a collision course with the Milky Way. In about 4.5 billion years, the two galaxies will merge, creating a new structure often referred to as Milcometa. 
This impending collision is a natural consequence of gravitational forces, illustrating the dynamic nature of galaxy interactions. The eventual merger will create new star systems, altering the cosmic landscape. Beyond the local group, the Virgo supercluster. Our local group is a small part of a much larger structure, the Virgo supercluster. This supercluster spans approximately 110 million light years and contains thousands of galaxies. It's just one of millions of superclusters scattered throughout the observable universe, connected by a vast cosmic web of filaments and voids. These superclusters represent the large scale structure of the universe, a testament to the grandeur of creation. Galaxies within the Virgo supercluster vary greatly, from massive ellipticals to irregular shapes. Their diversity reflects the myriad processes that govern cosmic evolution, offering astronomers a wealth of phenomena to study. The observable universe is a sphere with a diameter of about 93 billion light years, filled with galaxies, stars, and unimaginable distances. Within this expanse, there are an estimated 2 trillion galaxies, each containing millions or billions of stars. The Hubble Space Telescope has captured images revealing thousands of galaxies in just a tiny patch of the sky, illustrating the universe's sheer enormity. Among the universe's many stars are true giants. Consider V.Y. Canis Majoris, a hypergiant star approximately 2,000 times the diameter of our sun. If placed at the center of our solar system, its surface would extend beyond the orbit of Jupiter. Yet even stars like this are mere specks compared to the vastness of galaxies. Other stars, such as neutron stars and pulsars, represent the extremes of stellar evolution. These dense remnants of supernova explosions challenge our understanding of physics as they condense enormous masses into incredibly small volumes. To grasp the scale of the universe, consider this. A million seconds equal about 11 and a half days, but a billion seconds equal over 31 years. Now imagine distances measured in trillions of miles with light taking billions of years to traverse them. These numbers are almost beyond comprehension, highlighting our universe's staggering enormity. In 1990, the Voyager 1 spacecraft captured an image of Earth from 3.7 billion miles away, showing our planet as a tiny, pale blue dot against the vastness of space. Astronomer Carl Sagan famously reflected on this image, emphasizing Earth's fragility and the unity it represents. This dot is home to every human who has ever lived, every dream ever dreamed, and every story ever told. Earth, despite its insignificance in size, is profoundly significant as the cradle of human life. The vastness of the cosmos doesn't diminish our value, but instead highlights the rarity and preciousness of our existence. It reminds us of the importance of preserving our planet and striving for unity as inhabitants of this tiny world. Human curiosity has always driven us to look beyond our horizons. From ancient stargazers mapping constellations to modern astronomers uncovering the secrets of distant galaxies, our quest for knowledge is unending. With each discovery, we gain a deeper appreciation for the universe's complexity and beauty. As we continue this journey, let us remember, this is Earth, this is our home. And though we are small, we are part of a vast interconnected cosmos, a story billions of years in the making. Our understanding of this story is just beginning, and the possibilities are as infinite as the universe itself.